continue. The soft sound of the wind brings me back to reality and back to reality. こうして昔の罪を数えてしまうのは悪い癖だと自分でも思う。You once showed someone mercy, which led to a catastrophe. 私が殺した人の数はどうせ数えきれない。たとえ救った数の方が。圧倒的に多かったとしてもそれは命を奪うという行為に対し許しにも救いにもならない繰り返すたびに心はだんだんと重い罪に飲み込まれて自由が利かない顔が自然と笑みを作るイデアの人としての仕事のため最初は誰にも疑われることなく信頼を得るために微笑んだいつの間にかその微笑みは顔に張り付いて取れなくなってしまったもう本当の表情など自分自身にもわからない時々考えることがもし彼を見逃してしまったあの時に戻れたのだとしたら私は彼を殺すのだろうかあの夜以来何度も自分に問いかけたが答えはただの一度 I mean that's, that's essentially you know like the what's it called the um the trolley experiment or like the trolley uh dilemma like you've got you know you've got on one on one set of tracks you've got someone you love and on the other you've got like five people that you don't know so like what's more valuable to you one life that you care about or five people that you don't know so this is like yeah this it's like the same sort of like circumstances but in this case it was like one boy to like i think it was like 35 percent of the population in europe died because of the black plague which is a very significant number but i feel like yeah <sighs> but i've never been able to reach an answer i mean i, I feel like mm, I feel like I could have done it, like killing somebody that you care about. But then again, they're not really related to you. Like the boy wasn't wasn't somebody who was connected to Saint Germain through blood or like family history that you kind of just met. So I feel like yeah. <laughs> like one person. To like what over 20 million people mm, i feel like yeah i feel like i could have yeah. what emotion i feel like if you've lived 2000 years i'm pretty sure that you've felt that emotion before and that's just love i guess you know like caring for somebody to the point where like you're happy to to forego i guess your goals and even your life to save somebody you know that's what it is love はるか昔に忘れてしまったはずの温かい感情が今私を苦しめていたこの感情はいつから心の中に生まれたのだろう I'm just yeah I'm just like I'm just surprised as this only happened once really like where I'm not even love it was like this kind of duty to be able to look after somebody um to nourish somebody uh, because they were in need of, of help like yeah and he's been here what two thousand years so i'm sure that that must have happened more than once 
not that not, not just one instance with the boy. Especially because he's yeah, he's living essentially as a regular person. Like I'm sure he must have fallen in love with somebody.私に殺されようとしているにもかかわらずなお私のことを信じようとしてくれたその時だったのだろうかいやきっとそのどれも当てはまらない彼女と重ねていく時間が少しずつ特別になっていく自分がいたいやそれはそれがそれが now, when it comes to love, like this idea of like loving somebody conditionally has to happen over time. It has to happen. It doesn't just happen right away. You have to sort of like develop the bond with somebody in your life. You can't just expect somebody to love you unconditionally, you know, unconditionally from the very beginning because that's impossible. Because otherwise, what do they, what does somebody have to do? to um for you to feel like like you, you love them unconditionally and I, I think the biggest thing that makes a difference is the time spent together and those experiences those memories and that re reality that you form with somebody you know you know the experience these two the time they spent with them but I guess yeah, like I said, I, I guess yeah, I'm not a huge believer of like love at first sight. Very much. I'll have to get something for Candice later. <laughs> A test? Mm. I just... I still don't know what... What is... Is Cardi going to do? Like, why does Cardi have to die? Why is the existence of Cardia like so um what's the word for it? So um pertinent to like the world collapsing at some point in the future. Like I don't I don't really get that. Like is 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 the game going to a real why Cardia is so evil? We know that she's a homunculus, which is somebody who is a human, but they were created artificially. She's actually a human bomb. She's a human bomb, what? Wait, so is she going to blow up? Okay, gotcha, gotcha. No, I'm coming, bitch. Ah. Okay. Okay, so hopefully, yeah, hopefully the game will reveal why that is. There's really no one here. I can't help but look around in amazement at the scene before me. 
It seemed exactly as the same as when I met Omnibus in the rain the other night. As I approach Tower Bridge, there is an unnatural decrease in the number of people. For the time, I'm halfway across the bridge. There's no sign of anyone else here. I glance down and see that the key in my hand is glowing dimly. It's probably thanks to the key that this key that I'm able to be here right now. Saint Germain here. I imagined his face as I look up at the sky and walk onward. The moon shines coldly down on everything. The night air is cold, and a hint of the running river sound reaches my ears. I stop at the center of the bridge. Suddenly, the sound of a large bell ringing shakes me. Even though there are no bells, the ties are on here. This must be another one of Omnibus's strange powers. Then, when the bell stops ringing, I hear footsteps approaching from behind me. I close my eyes and take a deep breath. I turn around. And there stands Saint Germain. The moonlight shines upon his face and highlighting his beauty. His expression is mask like, as if he's intentionally killing any emotion he might be hiding. あなたと嬉しいと思ってしまう自分がいます I feel the same way, and there's a lot I want to say to you. But for now, I'm just happy to see you. There's nothing more I can say. We stand facing each other with the same smell on our faces. We both wish that we can just forget what we come here for forever. Benjamin slowly begins to walk towards me. Not to rejoice in a reunion, but with an expression that mourns our farewell. Yes, instead, you protected me time and time again. From Finis and from Twilight, and even from uh, Ginev uh, I forgot, uh, Guinevere. The blank expression on his face wavers just little, and he stops before me. A silver blade emerges from Saint Germain's sleeve and reflects the light of the moon. I am already within his reach. If he wanted to, he could kill me in an instant. If I run, you'll die. Our eyes meet, and then he looks away. I don't know why you came
私はあなたを殺すべきなのかそれとも刃を下ろすべきなのか<音楽>カルディアさんあなたになら、その答えがわかるのですか This is the time to decide. There probably isn't much that I can do for him. I took a deep breath and exhale. Oh, okay. So, yeah, I think I have to be, yeah, don't hesitate. Yep.、Yeah. Don't hesitate. Yo, me, what are you talking about, Saint Germain? Cardio, son. I smile, clutching at my chest. I'm probably not smiling right. Still, I try my best to present, hi present him with some a semblance of a smile. I was never alive, so whatever you're doing, it's not killing me. Yes, that was the answer that has always been in my heart. The answer is my empty body. You heard from o n i v e r s e didn't you? You saw in that underground facility. Baba was not able to create a perfect form of life. I don't have a heart or emotions, I'm just a doll pretending to be lie to live. That's why. My voice trembles. In the end, this is the only thing I can think I can think to do that would lessen his pain. You don't need to hesitate or suffer over this. You're not killing a person, you're simply breaking a non living doll. It wouldn't be a crime. Saying this out loud actually makes me feel. I can't say it. Ah! e x i l l a r i t I could say it before, but I can't say it now. There isn't. e x i l l a r i t So, your main just says, I'm a smile in amazement. Now, say. Now, say, I'm not a w a s o n a k a o Suruno Deska. Koreka, I'm not a w a w a t a s h i n o t e d e Why he asks? There's only one answer to that. Because it will save you. You won't need to suffer any longer. If sacrificing this pathetic imitation of life will bring an end to Saint Germain's suffering. And remained. There's a hint of anger in his eyes. But as you know, I am not a man. 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 食事の後にティーカップを傾けて、私やルパンたちと世間話に興じること。Why is he trying to make it harder though? Like, it's like, if you don't want to do it, then just don't do it. Like, if he wants to really make it harder for him, like, and for everybody, like, you know, like, be like, you make it harder for everybody. Stop. Futari de Machi no Naka or Aruite, Kawari Yuku Machi Nami or Nagame Kotomo. But remind me, Watashi Tachi to Tomoni. You're making it this much, so much harder than it needs to be. Stop! I cover my ears and shake my head. I was trying so hard not to think about any of this. Why? Why would you say these things to me? Why now? I wanted to end my life with a smile. Telling me this, it just makes me fear death. This is not good. I can no longer hold my weakness. s a i Germain sees me at a loss for words and slowly begins to speak. Yeah, that's true, that's true. I'm just. I'm just surprised that this is like the first time that he's, you know, like he's, he's felt this way, you know, like he's, he's felt, he's felt, um, love for somebody, you know, like, 
he's lived for so long like on this planet and this is like the first time that he's he's felt in this way towards somebody i'm scared of death i've not been able to see your smile anymore of course i am afraid once the words begin pouring out i can no longer stop them i'm not even human i'm a monster but still i don't want to die i'm causing such a sin even though I know that my cries will only make Saint Germain suffer further. I want to live with you. <laughs> Saint Germain holds his blade up once more with a smile. With his peaceful smile, he slowly raises the blade higher. I hear the blades whisper through the air. The blade reflecting the, moon the moonlight stops directly in front of my eyes. Saint Germain. If he had continued his swing, he would have he would have been released from his tor torment. I look up, that found it. Saint Germain lowers his sword. But I am. Um... If so, wait, so if she's a doll, she could potentially live forever, right? She could live forever. And also. Why couldn't she become a member of IDEA? He puts the blade away, his voice trembling. And extends his hand to me. And he forcefully, I force, forcefully, grabs my arm and grips my, away my glove. What are you doing? Then remained, doesn't reply. He just gently presses my cursed hand against his face. Ouch! White smoke begins to rise in in instantly. And I hear the sound of burning flesh. He's like, what the fuck are you doing, buddy? What are you doing, Saint Germain? Let me go. I desperately tried to pull my hand away, but he won't release me. Please let go. A voice sounds like a scream. I can feel the sensation of a, l a loved one's life burning away. Against my skin, and Jermaine lovingly rests his cheek against my poison filled hand. That doesn't my words come to a stop. I finally realized that Saint Germain's isn't smiling. And Jermaine is crying. He's looking straight at me, weeping with an eternal sadness. These are genuine words, straight from Saint Germain's heart, unimaginably, unimaginably, unimaginably from his usual demeanor. 
The warmth of pressing his skin directly against mine tells me that he's speaking nothing but the truth. Aizuki. You know, anyway, is Daisuke like, I, I like you? Yeah, I think Daisuke like you. <笑>この先どんなことがあっても私がどれほどの罪を重ねることになろうとも But then you won't. Ginger Mane scrapes my hand tighter. He smiles more kindly than ever before. It's like I'm pretty sure that that's just your skin, your skin and the, the heat of your of the hand. Saint Germain's smile is unlike anything I've seen before. Gently releases my hand, looking reluctant. But at the same time, he, the horrible burn on his face begins to heal at an almost alarming rate. The skin on the side of his face had been charred, char black, but it returns to perfection as the time is running backwards. Your wounds healed. It's as if you'd never touch him. But the sensation still remains in my hand. I look down at my, at my still trembling hand. Saint Germain narrows his eyes slightly and looks at me. Eh? Mite no tori desu. You're not a monster, you shouldn't say that. <笑>その言葉はあなたにそのまま返しますよ Oh. We both smile at one another. Saint Germain's smiling face is just beautiful, as it, as it hadn't ever been. I stare intently at his face. どうしました? No, it's not that. It's just your smile has just now looked so natural. それはきっとあなたが私の仮面を外してくれたからです。Saint Germain smiles joyfully, then looks straight at me. But well, that means that he has to die, doesn't it? Because he's gonna he's gonna against the will of Omnibus, right? Because she was like, yeah, if he fails his son again, I am going to kill him. And then somebody else is gonna come and be sent and kill me. What do you have to do? Yeah. So we're fucked regardless. <laughs> yeah, we're fucked anyways. Benjamin stares into darkness beyond the bridge and squints, trying to find something. Mmm, 13 apostles. Right. 
How long will, be, will I be able to fight against a colossal opponent that has been controlling history itself? I remember Guinevere. If she were to attack again, there's no guarantee that I could get away safely. What? われわれは不死とは言っても絶対に死なないというわけではない。百か千か、それ以上か、何度も殺されれば私たちとて本当の死を迎えます。十二人の死とをすべてほふり、オムニブスを倒す。so we're gonna go up against like like the gods of the universe essentially. Saint Germain smiles as if what he said was completely normal. But I hastily raised my voice to raise the, prot the protest that crosses my mind. Wait, Saint Germain, you say you're going to defeat the apostles? But if you disobey, Omnibus, but won't she take away your immortality? So that's it. So he will be able to live for some time? Like he will be able to stay alive? So then there's no way you can defeat so many mortal beings like that. If you go on to fight, at least you can ask Lupin and the others for help to help you. He's in mortal in a way. Yeah, but he's he's gonna die anyways, like Omnibus is gonna take that immortality away. You no, know, she's gonna be like I have enough points for squat. Oh, okay, let me quickly kick you. <laughs> So I try to continue my protest. He raises his index finger. No. <laughs> no. That's bully. No, you bully. I got to another friend's stream. <laughs> I won't let you. Oh boy, I love you, baby. Bye bye. <laughs> Saint Germain smiles kindly, then strokes my hair. Soothingly. How oh, you stop me? Hey, how's it gonna fix Mania Gaming? Well, I can't really stop you from going, can I? Hello, dude. We're just chilling here. Um, I want you to leave with me. Saint Germain suddenly draws me close to him and satisfies me. Saint Germain gently whispers into my ear. I shake my head, wearily, and resist. There has to be another way. A way we can live together, and you won't be—you won't have to sacrifice yourself. 
We both want each other to be happy. It's not fair that one of us can be. Our happiness only works if we're in, in it together. That's why. No. That's Deflects my weak plea and begins speaking clearly. And that is my happiness. Peace. Is Mark. Okay, Fortnite. I haven't collected up a few times. But is it from like school or something? Or? Yeah, it's like next year the day. Oh, is it? Yeah. I can give it a right after that. Yeah. <laughs> Let's do it. He places his fingers gently against my neck. For a moment, a puff of white smoke rises out of it. It's gloves. No worries. I feel I like. I was I wasn't kicking you. What the hell? <laughs> I feel like a slight pain in my neck. It feels like my, a piece of me metal scratches against my skin, and there's a moment of delicate pain. Ah! Suddenly, my body grows weak. I slump down as if a strain holding me has been cut on has has been cut. No matter how hard I try to move my body, I cannot move at all. What did you do? Tebukuro ni shibire gusuri o shikonde okimashita. Daishoubu desu. Sugu ni ugokeru yo ni narimasu kara. Sindermain really does intend to die. My heart is certain of this, and yet, I am unable to change his mind. Tears overflow from my eyes and stream down my face. <sighs> my mouth is numb. <laughs> it was like the mouth, like, other. <laughs> my mouth is numb, and my lips will move. And speak. All I can do is stir at Saint Germain. His mouth, as he looks at me. Sanjermain says this quietly, and after stroking my hair for a moment, he turns his attention back to me. So I watch him disappear into the darkness. I want to run after him. I scream, don't go! Our arms and legs, nothing moves. All I can do is look on, on Saint Germain's. All I can do is look on as Saint Germain's walks away. Okay, we're gonna leave it there for now.